Hi guys, I'm Rehane. Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to show you how to crochet this beautiful motif pouch. This is so easy and very useful. You can put something into this pouch. I'm going to show you step by step. But before that, please subscribe my channel and like my video. Thank you. For this tutorial, I use cotton yarn as you can see. I use four, four color of these and a wooden bead for this part. As you can see, you can use just one color or two or more of this yarn. And I use a hook. The size of the hook is 30 millimeter and a pair of scissors and a needle to hide the extra yarn. So let's go to see how to crochet this beautiful motif pouch. First, I make magic ring. And then make two chain and one double crochet into this magic ring. Then I'm going to make just one chain and then we need two double crochet into this magic ring. So one and two. Again one chain and two double crochet. We need eight of this set into this magic ring. Now I finish this round and then I make slip stitch in the first stitch. And then I change the color and I'm going to go to this hole. I put the yarn here and then yarn into this hole and make a slip stitch then make four chain then in this hole I make triple crochet we need five of this but now we have this chain so here we need just four of this treble crochet so this is two try to hide the extra yarn here three and Then cut the extra yarn, this yarn, you must cut them. And now we have this shape. Put your hook here in the first stitch and then put your hook here, yarn over. Now we have popcorn stitch, then make three chain and go to the next hole exactly here. In next hole, we need five treble crochet. So one, two, three, four, and the last one, five. Then again, make a slip stitch. Put your hook here in the first stitch, and then put your hook here yarn over and make 
three chain. Now we have two popcorn stitch. In each space, we need just one popcorn stitch. I will continue this until I arrive here. Now I finish this round and I make three chain and then I want to make single crochet exactly here into this popcorn stitch make a slip stitch and then make just one chain then cut the yarn and use a needle to hide the extra yarn for next round i choose a different color i prefer green yarn color and then put the hook here between these two popcorn stitch exactly here and then yarn over make three chain now i have three chain then make two double crochet one and two then make two chain go to the next hole exactly here and make just one single crochet and two chain again and again one single crochet then i'm going to make two chain so here we have two chain then one single crochet again two chain one single crochet and again two chain then i'm going to this hole and make three double crochet so one two and three now i have this shape then we need three chain one two and three then again here we need three double crochet so one two and three now we have the corn then i'm going to this space before that we need two chain then again one single crochet two chain one single crochet and again two chain until we arrive here in the next hole here we need three double crochets so one two and three then exactly in this part we need three chain and again three double crochet so one two and three as you can see we have this shape we have two corner we must keep going until we arrive again here now i have three corner and i arrive here i make two chain and again here we need three double crochet so one two and three then make three chain and and then make a slip stitch in the third chain exactly here so as you can see we have when i arrive here again i change the color of the yarn 
and put my hook here yarn over and then make just one chain and fix it together like this and then make three chain and then we need two double crochets one and two as you can see we have this stitch here in this corner then I'm going to the next core next hole exactly here and again make three double crochets so one two and three then I'm going to the next hole again here we need three double crochet exactly here and then here we need three double crochet and here again we need three double crochet as you can see I have five three double crochet in each hole here then here then here here and here then when we arrive in this corner we need three chain and again three double crochet into this corner hole so one two and three now we arrive here in the next hole again we need three double crochets and then again in this hole we need three double crochet three double crochet and again in this corner three double crochet with three chain and again three double crochet and we must complete this round of this flower now I finish this round and I arrive here again I make three chain and make a slip a stitch into the third chain exactly here and then again into this hole we need three chain and two double crochet one and two and then into the next hole we need three double crochet so one two and three and again here between these three stitches here we need three double crochets one two and three again here between these two stitches we need three double crochet and then here we need three double crochet now i finish this three double crochet and i arrive here in this corner in this corner again we need three double crochet so one two and three so as you can see in this round we have one two three four five and six three double crochet and now i arrive here in this corner so here we need again three chain and we started this round again in each hole we need three double crochet so one two three four five and six until we arrive here in this corner and then here again we need three chain like this part and again six three double crochet so we must complete this 
I finished this round and in each corner we have one, two, three, four, five, and six of this three table crochet. And now I arrive here in this corner. I make again three double crochet. Then I'm going to make three chain and then make a slip stitch into the third chain exactly here. As you can see, then again just one slip stitch and just one chain and then cut the yarn. Now I complete this motif but we need two of this them so I make again another of this motif and I come back soon. Now I make another motif and I have two motif now. For the next step, I back this motif and put this motif above of this. And then here we have three chain. Put your hook in the third chain of this stitch. And then put your hook again in the third chain of this stitch exactly here. Yarn over and make just one single crochet. Again, put your hook in the next stitch of these two motif here and then here. Again, yarn over and make just one single crochet. I repeat this again. As you can see, yarn over and again just one single crochet. Now here in this stitch and here yarn over and make just one single crochet. Now we attach these two motif together and we must continue this single crochet here. Then when we arrive here we need three chain and again continue until we arrive here and then here and we don't need single crochet and this part just with this part we need just single crochet. Now I arrive here in this corner and as you can see I attach these two motif together with this single crochet and now when we arrive in this corner here in this hole we need three single crochet so one two and three then Put your hook in the next stitch of this part and next stitch of this part exactly here and again make just one single crochet. Again put your hook in the next stitch of these two motif and make just one single crochet. So keep continuous until you arrive again here and in this corner we need three single crochet so we need single crochet into this three sides not this part just this part now i finish this single crochet as you can see and when we arrive here in this corner we need just one single crochet then we need three chain and here in this corner not this just for this motif we need two double crochet one and two then we arrive here in this hole here again we need three double crochet So in each hole we need three double crochet again in the next hole we need three double crochet so one two and three so as I said in each hole we need just three single crochet here and then here in this hole 
Now I finish this round. As you can see, we have three double crochet in each hole. And then when we arrive here, we must to make just slip a stitch in the third chain. And then make just one chain and cut the yarn. Now again, I change the color of yarn. Put my hook here in the first pull. Yarn over and make four chain. Two, three, and four. Then make just one double crochet. And in the next hole exactly here, we need one double crochet, one chain and again, one double crochet, then go to the next hole, here we need just one double crochet, one chain and again, one double crochet. So in each hole, we need just one double crochet, one chain and again, one double crochet until again we arrive here now again i finish this round and i arrive here and now we make a slip stitch in the third chain and now again i make a slip stitch here in this hole and again here until we arrive in here as you can see, we have two holes. This hole is bigger than this hole. This V hole is smaller than this hole. So, in this bigger hole, we need just four chain again and just one double crochet. Again, we skip this hole, this V shape hole, and again in this Bigger, bigger hole we need just one double crochet one chain and again one double crochet again let's keep this v-shake hole and again here we need one double crochet one chain and again one double crochet and now we must continue with this until again we arrive here. Now I finish this round and then I need slip a stitch in the third chain. And then again make a slip a stitch until we arrive in this hole. And now in this hole we need three chain and double crochet one two three and four double crochet then in the next hole we need just one single crochet again in the next hole we need one two three, four, and five double crochet. And again, in the next hole, we need just one single crochet. So as you can see, we need five double crochet and one single crochet in each hole until again, we arrive here. For next step, I use different color and make 60 chain as you can see then cut the yarn and put this yarn between this stitch exactly here you can use a needle I use a needle, 
put the yarn here and then in this hole exactly here in this part put your yarn under this stitch and then above of this stitch then again under this stitch and above of this stitch like this and continue until again you arrive here now I finish this as you can see and then I use this put my yarn here then in this part exactly and make a knot like this and then cut the extra yarn now you have a very beautiful this as you can see again this beautiful pouch is useful to put something you like for example your makeup tools or your soap or everything you want thank you for watching my video if you like it please subscribe my channel and like my video and if you have any question put your question i will answer to you thank you